You're watching the Ideal Living Network. Welcome back to The Exchange with Lily May and Mr. Daniel Dickey. Woo, where's that yeah, applause? Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. Where's the applause? <laughs> see, <laughs> see, see, see that? And it's, and it's 4th of July weekend, so we figured we should get some, some fireworks go. and stuff, you know, up in here. I mean, there really. We That's there funny. we go. So, yeah, welcome welcome back to the show here every Thursday, of course. And we have a very special guest today. <sighs> uh, that sign means Daniel's liking what he sees. Yes. So he's too fresh. <sighs> but we have Miss <sighs> Antonique in the building. Hey. And you may have recognized her from Notorious, which her was <laughs> with her <laughs> fine self. Yes. For yes, Daniel, yes, Daniel yes, with her yes. beautiful. Yeah, I never knew it was a love like this before. <laughs> <laughs> So we're going to talk about what's going on with her, some of her new music, and some exciting things that she has in store in the uh, second segment. But speaking of music, this weekend is Essence Festival. Yes, yes, the 20th Yay. anniversary of Essence Festival. So this oh, is I like know a, that. Oh, yeah. This is know, a big one. This is, well, I mean, Essence is amazing oh, all the time. But, yeah, the 20th anniversary of anything is pretty amazing mm. if you can do anything for 20 years. So who's going to be performing? Well, I mean, I think it's... Prince is definitely gonna be performing. Oh. I think that kind so of just sums, sums it up. Right. Like that's the beginning of right. <laughs> Nobody else performed that tonight. So, so it doesn't matter. But the Alpha and the Omega of yeah. the lineup. Gotcha. Yeah. So Prince is gonna be performing, which is really exciting. Um, I heard about a couple other performers, but unfortunately, I'm not going, so I won't get. To, oh my gosh, Jasmine Sullivan is performing. Oh, yes, yeah, nope. she's coming back. Yes, yeah, wow. she is. I didn't even mm -hmm. know she was coming back. I'm such a huge fan of hers and Trey Song. But is she a really? Is she a huge fan? She doesn't know she's coming back, and she's well, got a new song. How you feeling? He's firing shots already. Yeah, I know, right? Dang. Three minutes. Can we call the shot? On this. Yeah. No, 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 no. No, I didn't. I, I'm kind of in my own world sometimes, so I don't get to. But that's true. You, you gotta yeah, know I'm what's going on. Single single was like out. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, it's what? Yeah, shots yeah. being fired, low key for Yes, key. yes, yes. Light shots, like little shots, <laughs> like tiny little, shots, little, little pellets, the pellets. Yes. Exactly. But I didn't know that. I swear I didn't. But you have seen Antonique. Um, probably, I guess the most recently would have been the Notorious movie, mm -hmm. which is really, really huge. Yeah. And it was just so I ironic like that not only do you favor Faith, but you also sing for mm -hmm. real. I do. Uh -oh, yes. Oh, yes. Look, yes. So tell us about, you know, the music career and, and what's going on with that right now. Oh, my God. I'm so excited, y'all. My first single is on iTunes. Uh -oh. on Amazon. Okay. Oh, awesome, awesome. Mm -hmm. And describe the single. Like, what's the sound? What's that sound? Yeah, what type of well, I like to call my sound pop soul with a hip-hop appeal to it. Mm -hmm. So we got a little floor system? Yeah, because it's kind of like, I grew up in church, singing in church. But the first person I heard, from? I'm from East Orange, New Jersey. Oh, New Jerusalem. Jersey, girl. <laughs> and um, Whitney Houston is also from East Orange, New Jersey. When I was a little girl, okay. Whitney Houston I heard her voice. Yes, the Whitney Houston, the voice, the most amazing ever. Um, when I heard her voice as a little girl, I was like, I want to sound like that. Mm -hmm. And so that's just how I started singing. I would just practice her music. Um, I sang in church, you know, I practiced to Celine Dion and Mariah Carey and mm -hmm. Rita Franklin. And so that kind of developed that big pop vocal style mm -hmm. of mm -hmm. singing. And man, I love Mary J so much and I loved hip hop so much growing up um, that that influence you know, I, I want a hard beat under my stuff, too. Uh -oh. Right, right. So that's why I call it pop soul with a hip-hop appeal to it. It's like a fusion of, you know, how I sing and what I like to listen to. Mm -hmm. So tell us so tell us about the single, because we're going to go right into it here in a second. Well, the single show. is aggressive. Uh oh You know, it's got that young Aretha Young, you know, like that old retro feel. We have a lot of greats around here. Whitney, Aretha, people. sweetheart. No, we got some work to do it's now. It's that moment where you figure out something is just not right. Mm -hmm. you know, whatever the injustice is, you know, ladies, you're cooking dinner at 8 p.m., you come home at 4 a.m. smelling like perfume you don't wear. Oh, that's not Hold on, wait a minute. You know, and the guys yeah. have it too. Hold you know, she's trying to say she's pregnant and it's not uh, yours. Yeah, and she's trying to say it's yours. That's yeah, not that's what what But if it is yours, that's not hold away, man. Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. sorry. Okay. You know that we don't we don't accept that one. Right. So it's for the guys and the girls. It's for everybody. You know, you know the, the Nigerian girls get kidnapped by grown men. It's mm -hmm. like hold away a minute. You know what I'm saying? Abuse, bullying, racism, all of it. Hold Donald up. Sterling. Oh, hold away oh, a minute. Okay. We put our foot down. That's a big big hold up. So, ladies and gentlemen, without any further ado, hold up. Wait a minute. 